Welcome back to Breakfast Television at lunchtime. That's right, we are live from Taste of Edmonton during the lunch hour because it seems completely appropriate and I'm inviting Rich into one of my dream come trues. One of the vendors, if you will, one of the fabulous offerings at the Taste of Edmonton, as is every year, are green onion cakes. And oh my goodness, it is almost like I've died and gone to heaven. This would be heaven. And if there was ever an island that was only had one food that would provide food for me for the rest of my life, I would say it would be green onion cakes. And Chip, welcome to Breakfast Television. Thank you, Bridget. You were going to take me on a how to make a green onion cake, which I'm going to absorb this knowledge and then live day by day eating only green onion cakes. First of all, how hard are they? Actually, it's very easy to make. You, really? just, you just need a mixer and some simple ingredients you can find at home. Okay, all right, talk me through. Let's make, let's start the creation okay. of green onion cakes. We need uh, all purpose flour. Okay. Okay, then we can add some uh, sugar. Okay. Salt. Sugar, salt, flour. So far, this seems very possible. Okay. This is optional, some little bit, pinch of MSG. Pinch of MSG. A pinch of white pepper. Okay. Sesame oil. Okay. And then water. Now, if you have a mixer at home, you can mix it at medium speed for about five, 10 minutes. Okay. If you don't, you just have to use your hand and knead. knead. I noticed that you have like so you gloves mix on. It, you mix it, mix it, it'll uh, become like a pizza dough. Okay. Okay. At the very end, you add the green onion to it. Okay. Okay. And then you knead it for about one minute. You knead it for one minute. And then through the magic of television, we're gonna remove this. And ladies and gentlemen, Phase two. Uh, like what? Now, is this one big green onion cake? Have I died and gone to heaven? This, it's probably about 12. Oh, <laughs> all right. Or one delicious one. Okay, so 12. So what happens here? Now, you have to uh, thin it out, okay. roll it out. Okay. Oops, sticky. I need some oil. Need some oil. And, and while he's getting some oil, I would like to point out that um, we're making green onion cakes. Awesome! They're also cooking green onion cakes over there. Uh, but the, but the, but 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 I I'm jumping the queue here. We're still looking for some oil, making green onion cakes. Okay. okay. So you're now slapping on the oil so that it doesn't bind like it was before. Yeah. So you have to roll it out. Okay. And then sprinkle more green onion. More green onion. I would like to point out too that it is quite hot under here, and the festival has just begun. These guys are soldiers, soldiers of green onion cake. Okay, okay. all right. So once once we put green onion, we have to just roll it out like this. Now you're, oh, I see. And this is what gives it that sort of swirly look. Yes, exactly. Uh-huh. The dough actually rise a bit, but uh, that's okay. Through the, ma <laughs> through the magic of television again, we are expediating the process, as it were. So you're cutting these down. This is what is giving it that okay. swirly look you right there. The look, and then you just have to press it like that. And there's your green onion cake. Okay, then, ba -ba -da -da, then we head over here, and let's say that you slap that onto the grill. Excuse me, sir. Okay. And this is the final process. This is the final process. Okay, first you have to heat up the oil. Uh -huh. uh, make sure it's very hot, otherwise uh, it won't be tasty and brown. Okay. okay. <laughs> and I'm actually going to do the honors. I'm gonna, I'm can I flip this one? Yeah, you may flip that one. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my, so look at here. these. Oh, my God, these are perfection. These are perfect. Ladies and gentlemen, the grill is open. The green onion cakes are on. And that is how it goes. Chip, thank you, thank, thank you. you. Thank you very much. You can come over anytime. We can have a granny making party. That would be fantastic. And then of course, there's the competition. Ah, uh, stay with us. Take a look at this. Very cool. Uh, so here we are live in Churchill Square. As you can see, day one of Taste, Ed Taste of Edmonton uh, has brought the crowd down. Beautiful conditions, Bridget, for a green onion cake eating contest. Perfect, some would say. Uh, we have Tristan over here. Let's hear it for Tristan! Yeah. All right. So All right, and to, Tristan. uh, to Tristan's right, we have Taylor, Team Taylor. Woo! Let's hear you. I love it. Okay, so here's the deal, Bridget. Our thanks to Hong Kong Bakery for providing these famous green onion cakes. We're going to give these guys one minute. Okay, now they both uh, have the option with some sour cream and some of the famous hot sauce, which of course would just be some chili, uh, some crushed chilies. Uh, I would go for it myself. I think they're both going to opt out. We'll see. We'll find out because right now, let's get to the contest. Are you guys ready? All right, studio, are you ready? Studio is ready. Please cue the time clock on, on your marks. marks. Get, Get set, set, go! go. All right. Hey, oh. Interesting. The fold over, Bridget, immediately evident okay. from a strategy side here with Taylor. 
Oh, wow. Now, I know a thing or two about pancake eating contests. This, of course, would be part of the cake eating contest. It can get jammed pretty quickly, guys. So go easy. Breathe through your nose. I feel like you water. might want to roll a little water yeah, into this Yeah, go mix. for the water. You know, Take your time. It up a bit. Yeah. So now we, of course, maybe they have 15 green onion cakes potentially to make their through, their, themselves through in the first hour. Uh, right now, both of them kind of a little bit more ponderous. Maybe this isn't going the way they had hoped. I heard some talk. Guys, you have 30 seconds left. I heard some talk of hopefully I can get through one stack right. in a minute. I don't know, but you know I what? I think getting through one green onion cake yeah. would be a triumph. Okay. Okay, you gotta be we proud have of how one down. You have 15 right seconds yeah, left. <laughs> if you can get that taken down. Oh, eight. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. I think we like your chances. <laughs> More. Just put it in. Just put it in. Just, okay, now close. Okay. There. <laughs> I don't know about you, Bridget. <laughs> Are we declaring it? I a, think it's a tie. Is it a tie? I think it's a tie. They're both like Guys, full mouthed. Yeah, I mean. There are these rules, but you got to have it all swallowed and all that. But I mean, that's just semantics. That's gray area. We're not too concerned about that. How do you feel, Taylor? I feel like I just ate more than I should have. But what can I say? What can I say? Tristan, Tristan how you is doing? still making his way through. He's um. If if you need to sort of go under the table and use the option of ex exiting whatever is in your mouth into a napkin, please feel free to do so. We hear. <laughs> there you have it. Look at this. This is why crowds gather at eating contests. Guys, we're going to split up the grand prize. We're going to send you home with some BT swag, a whole bunch of food tickets here for Taste of Edmonton, awesome. and then VIP evening passes to the Sip and Savor tent, which is wide open for business through this week as well. Nicely done, Tristan and Taylor. Yeah. More on a very special noon hour edition of BT to come. We're at Churchill Square, day oh, one of Taste draw. of Edmonton. But there's some leftover green